Well, what's going on? Come back. I got a birthday present to show you. What's going on, everybody? How's my outdoor crew doing on this Tuesday? Hope this video finds you well. Um, got a new toy for my birthday. And I'm fixing to put it together. And then we're going to take a look at it a little more. Whoops. We'll go back this way. But uh, let me show you the box. If you watch Sunday's or Saturday's video, you may have seen a glimpse. But what we got is a 17-inch Blackstone griddle with hood, side burner, and fryer. So I'm going to get this thing put together and then we're going to take a tour of it a little bit and let you know how I'm going to use it and what I'm going to do with it besides cooking a bunch of cool food. Alright, so I'm going to show you a little bit as I put it together. Um, it's got a little rubber feet on it right now, but the way I may be using this thing may take those off eventually. Um, I'll explain that a little bit more here in a little bit. But, uh, man, this thing is sweet. I mean, it is sweet. I'm going to put the knobs on. Uh, you know how their proprietary system works as far as igniting the flame. Uh, if you don't, this is the Blackstone Adventure Ready Cook Anything, Anytime, Anywhere series. Um, so let me get laid on the side. i got to put the still got to put the handles on it. It's got carry handles on it. i got to put those on there. And... Uh, We'll get it assembled, and you'll see what all she's got. All right, now I'm putting the uh, handles on the side. You got four nuts and uh, four screws and nuts. I'm a 10 millimeter wrench. I'm gonna fill the screwdriver. We'll tighten these up, both sides, real quick. I've heard people say I hate putting things together. I don't. I love using my hands for something constructive. And this kind of stuff I like doing. Um, so you'll know too, this is the one that uses the... Uh, hang on a second. Where is it? This one uses your big tanks. It doesn't use the five pound cylinder. It uses the big uh, propane tanks. Um, you can get refilled and everything and now that I've looked at it and seen how it is I, I can understand taking it somewhere shouldn't be that big of a deal really now that I've looked at how it, how it works uh, it comes apart in two sections Oops, sorry that, that was probably loud sorry but the uh, burner or the um, cook grate grill sits over here and this is a burner that sits right here it all just lifts off so I can see how you could take this on a trip and I mean this part here is not very heavy at all I think they make a bag for that I'm going to look in the book and see a little more um, may do a little more investigating before I go very far in this video but uh, I'm going to tighten this other handle down We'll set the grates and stuff on and we'll take a look at it from there. Okay, she's put together now for the most part. I got one more piece I'm going to put on it, but I'm going to show you the how it sits right now. So this is the Blackstone 17 inch with side burner. So there's your, there's your griddle part of the Blackstone right here. And then there's your side burner. You put a pot or whatever you want to cook on right there but there's something else that can go there that i've got so let me shut the lid let me get this other piece out put it together and put it on here and y'all really gonna go Phew. that's cool okay so you seen the blackstone part you see that it's got the griddle and everything 17 inch griddle um you can cook quite a bit of stuff on that for a family but you haven't seen what's over here besides the burner are you ready? This is going to blow your mind. You come with a deep fryer. It's got a deep fryer on it. So you can, you can, uh, look at this, the endless possibilities of this thing. 
I mean, it's it's incredible. Um, now you can take this off. You don't have to have it on there. You can just use the side burner if you want to, or you've got just the griddle if you want it, or you can fry up the griddle, be doing some burgers and doing some fries and do it all. So it's the Blackstone Adventure ready. Cook anywhere, cook anytime, cook anything. That's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. She gets me. She knows me. What I'm trying to figure out, what I'm trying to do is um, I want to stand for this to go on the deck right beside my, well, what I consider the only other grill there is, is a Weber kettle grill. I've got it sitting out there on the deck. That's what I used to do a lot of grilling on. But this bad boy, I'm going to be doing a lot of cooking outside. Um, so I want to find a, make a stand for it or something. Uh, we're going to come up with some way of putting it outside, covering it up so it's outside and ready to use all the time. It does have a drip pan system right here. This clips on the back so all your drippings go in this. It doesn't... Um, just go out on the deck or on the floor or the ground or whatever. But um, I guess you could take this anywhere you wanted to, camping-wise. Um, sitting back and looking at it now, with it coming apart like it does, and I'll flip it around so y'all can see. This lifts completely off. Of course, this lifts completely off. So you just got the base and this separate. I think they make a bag for this. I'll look it up and see. But I think they make a bag for this that you can slide this in and you just slide this in the back of the truck. I know it's kind of big and with that, you know, using a 20 pound propane, you also get the smaller propane cans. Uh, cans. Uh, I think make five pound, maybe three pounds, something like that. And uh, you could take this camping. You could very easily take this camping. Now, I've thought about on my truck putting a slide out on one side of the bed. And with that, I could put this on one side with my other cooking stuff all on that slide out. So it slides out and you've got your cooking abilities on one side of the truck. And we'll see. I mean, it's not very big. It's only, I think, uh, I measured it early. It's like, well, shoot, let me throw the tape measure across it again. I did not measure with the handles, but in the truck... Hang on, you're going to get kind of a weird view for a second. Well, 37 inches long. So if I was to put this on kind of a slide out where it would come out of the truck like so, then that would work great. That would really work great. But for now, she's going to live on the deck under cover. It'll be covered up all the time. I keep my Weber. I love that piezo lighting system too without batteries or anything. So you don't ever have to worry about that. But um, yeah, this is this is pretty darn sweet, guys. And you can take this off. It's it kind of forces itself down there. But you can take this off, and um, like I said, use this as a side burner. So if you wanted to cook um, burgers or stuff or steaks on here, and maybe you know boil up some broccoli or something on there, you can. Or you could do it on there, all of it on there, whatever. But uh, I got all kinds of accessories for it. She, I mean, she did me right. It's my love. That's my baby right there. She knows me. But uh, yeah, this is pretty darn sweet, guys. Blackstone Adventure Ready cooking setup here. I mean, it's it's pretty cool. I don't know what else to say about it. All right, guys. Hope you liked the video. Like, share, subscribe. Send me your stickers for the beer fridge. Don't forget to check out all my links down below, the website, get your hoodie, your t-shirt. Rep Mid-10 Outdoors. Um, I would sure appreciate it. And go check out my medic, my sponsor and everything. And uh, we're getting ready. We're getting ready to hit outdoors. And this may go with us eventually. We'll see. If I do what I'm talking about with the slider, that would work out perfect. All right, guys. That's it. Be prepared.